हेलो फ्रेंड एक्स बात फॉर आई फ्रेम एलिमेंट्स एंड फॉर आई फ्रेम सो इट्स वेरी सिंपल एंड स्ट्रेट फॉरवर्ड देर इज़ नो डिफरेंस राइटिंग इन एक्स बात फॉर आई फ्रेम्स एंड आई फ्रेम एलिमेंट्स इट्स सेम एज वी राइट एक्स बात फॉर अदर एलिमेंट्स नॉर्मल एलिमेंट्स जस्ट दैट वाइल हैंडलिंग दीज एलिमेंट्स इन आर ऑटोमेशन स्क्रिप्ट देर वी हैव टू स्विच इन साइड आई फ्रेम एंड देन वी इंट्रैक्ट otherwise in x path writing there is no difference and let me give you an example so here so here uh, suppose and if you like okay first when you will inspect how will you get to know that this element is inside i frame or not so uh, just inspect the element and uh, here in the dom you see if the the inspected element is inside i frame tag then that means that x element is inside i frame so with the bare eyes sometimes it becomes difficult but here you can see that yes it is not inside any i frame okay but if it is inside any i frame let me if any element is inside i frame how you will get to know that let's inspect this element here so this button now let's see if it is inside i frame just you will have to scroll the dom so yes you see that this is inside this i frame so that means the element which we have inspected here is inside i frame now how selector sub has made it easy so it is like because every time it is tough to like scroll in the dom and see so you just open selector sub here it will let you know that this element is inside i frame and here how can we write the x path for i frame so you just start typing here and you see you would be able to write and verify the x path for i frame elements and we have to write the x path for i frame inside which this element lies this i frame so you just inspect this element here and this is not inside i frame so you can i mean basically this is i frame tag so it will be normal element and the element which is inside i frame that will go here and if you want to like save time here so you can see that selectors of itself gives you the i frame x path as well as x path and all the selectors for the inspected element here so that you can use so it is very simple straight forward if i turn it off so you see you just inspect the element and if the inspected element is inside this i frame tag that you will have to check it in the dom otherwise in selectors of by default it will tell you so no need to worry so this is how you can handle the you can write the x path for uh, i frame elements and you can verify it's same logic for x path there's no difference okay so yes that's uh, all about i frame and i frame elements x path next tutorial we will uh, learn how to handle the dynamic elements which disappear from the dom okay yeah thank you